Apple fans are flocking to stores across the country for the latest iPhone today. Chopper 4 showing us some of the lines outside stores here in South Florida. Now there's some real excitement about the release of the new iPhone 10. And CBS 4's Bianca Peters went to the Apple store on South Beach to talk with some of the proud new owners. If you're not first, you're last, right? Hell yeah! Sorry, yes. <laughs> yes, I'm excited. Officially the first in line to get the iPhone X at the Apple Store on Lincoln Road, but for Sheena Van Dyke, second in line isn't too bad for the latest phone. It's very important. I get every phone. iPhone 8, iPhone 7, iPhone 6, all of them. <laughs> so I have to have the 10. Lines stretched around the building from the early hours of the morning, some staying overnight and some coming from the other side of the world to spend about a grand on the new iPhone. I've come 12,000 miles away from Africa. But I don't buy it for myself, I buy it for my wife. Whether it's for you or a soon to be very happy wife, the new iPhone boasts features including a screen that runs side to side, top to bottom, and a face ID which unlocks your phone when you look at it. It's awesome, it feels so much better than the older one. Employers, beware though, we foresee a little slump in productivity for the new iPhone X owners. I'm stoked, man. So I'm gonna be at work all day playing on it. I'm sure I'm not gonna get anything done. It's gonna be awesome. Well, all these people in line here today are going to be walking home with the new iPhone X, which drops today. Now, seen a lot of videos about some of the features that it has, but it seems the wildest one is that facial ID recognition. Now, how that works, the iPhone's going to project about 30,000 infrared dots on your face, and you have to paint a circle with your nose to uh, apply that to it. So if you're walking around and you're seeing people doing this to their phones, now you know why. Reporting in Miami Beach, Bianca Peters, CBS4 News.